Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today we're doing another version of Jupiter Plays All the Games, this time with the Christmas Game Jam 2016. The Christmas Game Jam 2016 was a pretty straightforward jam. Developers need to make a game that had something to do with Christmas, either stuff that happens on the holidays or stuff that happens around winter time. I've been playing all of the games for about a minute each, 10 per video. Links to the individual games will be in the description, so you can check them out, and all my info will also be in the description, so you can check me out. Thank you very much for watching and liking and commenting. Next. We're playing New York Christmas. Well, let's play the tutorial then. Use mouth to look around. Mouth? Mouse. Use WSD to move. Okay. Press E to take a present. Ooh. Use the space bar to jump. Now find out where the uh, where is the chimney to drop your present down. I don't know. Probably back there. Uh, it's over there. Okay. So I've left my presents on rooftops, which is, you know, a bit un Santa Clausy. I must be new to the job. Alright, good job. Now press E to drop it. Merry Christmas. Oh, okay, level one. I like how this all takes place on, like, rooftops. You can sort of see the city. Ooh, there's the gift. Oh, now we need to look for the chimney, which is over there. And then we can just... Eventually, I guess the snowflake means that we get to grow a tentacle. Which sounds all sorts of weird, but... Merry Christmas! Yes. Level 2. There's a gift. It's a pretty nice game. Where is the chimney? Okay, so there's some stuff over there. We shall go grab them. Press E to gather some ice shards to fill your ice power. Oh, we need quite a few ice shards. That's not even enough. Maybe that's enough for this. Left click to create an ice bridge. Okay. I don't really trust that. Okay, maybe I trust it now. Cool. Merry Christmas. Next. The next game we're playing is Christmas Eve in Metatropolis. This game is for people who are 18 years or older. So if you're under 18 years or you get offended easily or don't want to look at stuff that's titled for 18 years or older, you can click in the description on the next time for the next game and just bypass this game completely. That's fine, but I'm going to play this game now, so there's your warning. Collect ten hidden objects and hand them out to those who need them most. Use mouse wheel or touch to look around. I'm going to use mouse wheel to zoom. Alright, um, just collect items and drag it from your inventory. Santa's busy this year, giving him a hand by collecting and handing out presents. Oh, that's a bit loud. Alright, ooh, I was trying to use mouse wheel, but the game is actually on a computer screen, so, hmm. So I made the game full screen. I'm sorry about the activate windows stuff. Right, so we need to find a lot of things. This person looks like dying. She's just thrown off. Oh, being abducted by aliens. Okay. There it's oh, she's being sacrificed. There's a lot of weirdness going on here. Maybe you are There you go. We've made that guy happy. She looks like she's being arrested. An elf. Take his flowers. Yeah. Christmas party. Nope. He's peeking in on his neighbor. Ooh. He took the pants off a baby. A lot going on. I don't even know what everyone needs. She looks like she actually needs a character supper. Or something. She looks upset. The girl that's cooking. Hmm. Next. We're playing Reindeer Run in the hit tutorial. Yeah, and click on each reindeer to control them individually. Use arrow keys to move them. Don't let them get or Santa gets or Santa get hit by the ice. Alright. 
Alright, so whatever one you control, you then need to control. Oh gosh, this is going to be very, very difficult. We're probably going to die. Yeah. I like how hand-drawn everything looks. It's very, very cute. Okay. Kind of want them all to be close together, it seems. We just need to survive as long as possible. This is a really cute, well-made game. Keeping Santa safe against these evil ice blocks. I definitely like the Grinch at the end as well when we died. That's a nice little touch. Ah! Speaking of the Grinch. Ah! I think Santa's gonna get hit. Yeah. Darn. Next. We're playing Naughty Slash Nice. This game's also available for Android, but I'm playing the web version. Ho, ho, ho. Well, I suppose that time of year for me to carve into the old naughty and nice list. Hmm. Uh, where is it? Should it be right around here? I say, Elf, have you seen my list lately? I think I saw Reginald. Reg the Elf always have weird names. With it yesterday. Could you fetch the lad? I'm getting a bit anxious without my list. Yo, Santa, what's up? I believe you did something with my list. Could you please return it? Ah, uh, no can do, bro, because I did you one better. I'm bringing this whole operation into the 21st century. I streamlined your entire list into an app. An app? But what about the giant scrolls and my giant feather pen? Ah, uh, that UX is so outdated and inefficient. Also, come on, man, print is dead. I, uh, but Christmas, the children. That'll be fine, Santa. Here, let me show you how it works. This app is called... Wait, yeah, so I call this app Naughty Slash Nice, I gotta say... The slash. Oh, slash. Very good, Santa. Anyways, this is your user interface. Right here in the middle, this is the kid, how long they've been a believer, and what they did this year, and what they want. This gauge over here measures Christmas cheer around the world. If you let it get too high or too low, there could be consequences. This one's workshop magic, represents the toys we can make. If it gets too high or too low, there'll be dire consequences. Yeah, I got it. So how do I make mark the kids as naughty or nice? Swipe left for naughty, swipe right for nice. I think you got your handle on it. Hit me up if you've got any questions. I'm at original Reginald, Reginald, Elf on Twitter. All right, named Becky. Believe for six years. I visit grandparents. Wants new clothes. Clothes for Christmas. You're probably nice. Named Gus. Believe for five years. Put a frog in daddy's briefcase. Wants silly string. Nope. All right. Shoplifted a video game. Nope. Uh, three years donated a month's allowance for Doctors the Borders. It's a very good charity. Who wants a cardboard puppet theater? Yep. All right. Elizabeth lied to both mommies. Wants a life-like animatronic stuffed animal. Yeah, sure. Catherine. Believe her for three years. Defended friend from bullying. Wants a doll. Sure. Jimmy. He believed for four years. Clean room, but did a lackluster job. Well, he tried. Oh, so there's stuff is that one actual pony. Like, that takes a lot of the elf's time. This is a pretty interesting game. Very simple, but nice. Next. We're playing Night Before Christmas, Elves Gone Wild. Objective, get the... There's a lot of gifts around. Are those the gifts that I need to get? Okay. Here's the gifts. How do I get them? There's the sleigh. Yeah, okay. Place the gifts on the sleigh. Hi, reindeer. Thank you for helping me. Alright. Distribute gifts. Okay. Oh. Oh, no. How do I do that? I'm not even a good shot. Oh, wow. If I just shoot out gifts, probably we'll hit some, right? I'm sorry, kids. Christmas is all over the lawn this year. <laughs> There's gifts everywhere. Ugh. The poor reindeers, instead of slowing down, just keep taking me around the same course, hoping that one of these times I'll actually do well. Oh, we can, like, shoot in front of us, though. Oh, there we go. Everyone gets double gifts this year. It's like a gift on this side. Get a moment. Get a 
get it? No, I don't think so. It's very challenging. You can't really shoot them directly into a house. Next. We're playing Bob the Angry Reindeer. Alright. So, we want to shoot stuff that we don't like because we're Bob and we're angry. So I think gifts we shoot. Yeah, we definitely shoot gifts. We can collect whiskey. Oh, I shot the whiskey. Bob the angry and not quite slightly drunk reindeer. Nope, I definitely just shot the whiskey. Oh, we don't have to avoid trees. Okay. And that gives us more health. So far we're doing great. Lots of presents. Lots of us shooting out of our nose. It's a very simple shooter, but it feels nice. Poor Bob. A lot of gifts. Next. We're playing Santa's Gift Frenzy. Alright. We wanna just pick up the gifts, not get hit by the naughty kids throwing snowballs at us, and put the gifts in our sack. Which isn't red, which is a bit weird. It looks kind of like a garbage bag, but you know. Budget cuts. Awesome. Great. 18 seconds. That was very fast. Alright, we get to play again. Level 2. We can only pick up one present at a time. Fine. I like the cute little Santa. Oh, oh, I got hit by a snowball. Did I lose? Okay. Grab this one. I don't like being close to the edge of the screen for very long because I feel like that's a dangerous area. Bam. Merry Christmas. Very simple but well made game. Next. Last but certainly not least, we're playing Christmas is Coming. I'm playing the Android version on my Nexus 7 tablet, though there is an iOS version and it's free. So you can download it on either device. There were two other games into this jam. One was for Mac only and one was for VR only. I tried to play without a VR but I couldn't. So yeah. We'll do a tutorial maybe. Collect. Oh, swipe to. Oh, sorry. I thought it was like an interactive tutorial, I guess not. Swipe to collect. Okay. Click to drop. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm sure it'll be fine. That's zero gift, so. Wow, and uh, so far, I've not done well. I get it, so green ones are swipeable gifts. When you throw a gift into nowhere, you lose. That's always good. So far, I'm not doing great. Not gonna lie. There's another heart gone, probably. Santa, I need a little bit more guidance. I feel like sometimes I'm not swiping you and you're dropping. That was a big house to miss. I'm doing bad though. Oh, we can move the gift while it's in there though. So, that makes things a whole lot easier. Nope. Ugh. We still made it, though. That gift. We're not bad. We're not bad as Santa Claus. Anyway, thank you very much for watching and liking and commenting. Bye!